listen, pal, I am going to be the only one flapping my doodle around here. You understand? Because I'm playing Moby Limbs, and we're in a place where that's okay in public. This is the only place where it's okay to flap your doodle in public. Is there a lemming in the house? God, I hope so. Because if there's not, can't really... Oh my. Oh, this is going to get scary. Let's see. Is there a lemming in the house? Actually, is there a floater in the house? What's with the random capitalization in this title? Is there a lemming? Is there a grade A USDA inspected lemming in the house? I'm not taking those grade F lemmings that just splat when you drop them from wherever. 20 lemmings, 80% to be saved, so I can only kill four of them. And they come out at a release rate of one, which is actually uh, pretty nice. Oh, and they're split evenly, so I can go ahead and... Uh, hmm... Let's see, how will I how will I accomplish this? Let's go ahead and send out a floater first. Okay, good. So now I gotta be really careful. I can theoretically save everybody. And I would like to do that actually. Let's go ahead and uh let's go ahead and do some target practice. Okay, everybody's safe. That's probably for the better. Now let's go ahead and Let's do some investigative digging. I always like to dig at the edge of these arrow walls. That's not that's not like technically a trick or anything, but I still think it's pretty nifty. So how are we going to get everybody out then? Well, they can all climb out to the exit. Maybe I should have had them climb out first, and then the last one should have done the digging. But you know what? I don't guess it really matters from a standpoint of things mattering and all that. You know what? Actually, it does matter to me. Uh, I'm going to restart, so let's go ahead. Now that we have the power and the knowledge. There we go. Everybody is safe and sound. So now, yes, I'm going to have all of them. Okay, I'm going to let them winnow their way into that little hole. Oh, man, kind of threw me off my rhythm game for a second. Got to use that rhythm method. If you don't want to have any limbing babies, let's go ahead and speed this along so that I can actually get... I'm a little bit impatient. I want to get to the part with the patience. I think I messed it up, actually. I think there's actually a thin bit of wall there. Yeah, I came in just a little too soon. That's what I get for rushing things. You can't rush limbing art, but fortunately we can replay this up to the point. Let's go ahead and do that. Ah... What a wonderful function. It's a balm to my soul. Wow, did you see how fast I did that? That was incredible. Okay, let's go ahead and uh, get you there now. Let's get you where you need to be and let's not be so scared this time. Let's wait till you're on the line. When you step to the line, that's when you know it's time to die. Let's go ahead and get our builder out now. Did I give him enough footing to be a builder? Golly, I sure hope so. Oh, man. Hoping and praying that I did. I think I did. I only see his foot dangling over the edge there. And we want to set it up so that he builds to here. And then... I don't know. Is that... Huh. Now, how are we going to set this up? How are we going to... How are we going to stack these dominoes? Uh, I don't know. I'm a little scared now. Should I dig just a little bit? I think... I think that's a wise course of action, in my opinion. Okay, and then let's do... Uh, I don't know. I was kind of debating doing a little staircase-y thing. Uh, I decided against it in the end. This is kind of a, this is kind of a treacherous position to be in. I, I'm not envious of having to build out of here. Um, I didn't have to save 100%, though, either, did I? Oh, man, this is going to get really ugly really quickly. And he's going to climb out of there, isn't he? He's going to... Hmm. He might, he might have to die just for the sake of simplifying this. There we go. I actually did that without holding down an arrow or anything. Okay, and now... No, 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 no. Don't build so high up that everybody... Well, now I guess... Well, I guess technically that makes things easier. I think... I think that only really made things easier for him, though. What? Why? How? What in the world? You know what? I'm just going to take it. I'm not going to complain too much about this particular solution. I'm just going to let it pass. I'm going to let it be. I think I kind of... 
I think I kind of made it more complicated than I had to. But you know what? There's still room for error. There's still margin for error in these early flap doodle levels. We're not quite to the exactitude that the custom scene is known for it yet. So I think we did just fine. Yeah. Yeah, let's all take a deep breath. <sighs> let's all just calm down. Calm down. We're still doing fine for now. I'm not screwing up in a horribly lethal way yet. And the long shadows. And the iguanas that stick their tongues out when you come near them. And the multiple entrances. And then the petite ones. 60, 90% to be saved. I can only kill six. And I have eight minutes to do this. What's, what's, the big, what's the big idea here? I seem to remember there are a lot of things you have to think about in the course of preparing for this level. Uh, one of them is... Okay, yeah, we're going to want to send two guys over. And we only have six builders. How are we going to sort that? Uh, we definitely need a blocker right here. And a blocker right here. And a blocker right here. And then a guy going on. Okay, yeah. I'm going to be doing some kind of ugly multitasking. Hopefully it all works out for the best. He's going to go on ahead then, and he is going to keep his compadres reined in. Okay, and now he's going to... Alright, we've got eight minutes here. Actually, we may want to just chill out for now. Let's go ahead and zoom out on this situation. We've got this going on here. So somebody's going to eventually come through and bash. Oh yes, we are going to be playing... We are definitely going to be playing Bash Brothers somewhere in the near future. Bash Brothers Brawl. Are they just calling the new Smash Brothers like Smash Brothers for Wii U and Smash Brothers for 3DS? Do they have like a name worked out for that yet or, or what? I always thought a cool name for the next Smash Brothers game would be like Smash Brothers Frenzy or Smash Brothers Lunatic Fringe or something. I always thought that would be kind of nifty. But hey, I'm not the guy that they pay to make up the names, so... And nobody really has to listen to me. Okay, so where is the best point to come down from? I think I think they'll still be fine if we... Okay, did I accidentally hit something bad? No, I didn't. I just I think I accidentally sausage-fingered F10. And I don't have any diggers, so it does not matter. Okay, we're going to get some guys walking to the left. We're going to get another guy walking to the left. And they're both going to be floaters. Which means they're going to be athletes. They're going to be the athletes who save the day. There we go. All right. So now, huh. All right. So now we're definitely going to have to have him be a blocker. What's so weird about this level that I'm not remembering? Oh, yes. You don't have any bombers. So you have to build over the digger in the, or the blocker in the end. Oh, yeah. That's why it's so weird. Oh, yeah. Okay, well, well, we're going to give ourselves some room to work here. Okay, and you can get up here in two bridges. That's what I have to do. I have to get up here within two bridges. And I have to basically nail it perfectly. Okay, that's what I was remembering about this level. Oh, no. Am I going to reach that? Mm, let's stretch it out. Stretch as far as you can. <laughs> Oh, yeah, that's what I was remembering about the... Yeah, I had a seat. Sneaking suspicion. I wasn't close enough. Hey, but it's pretty much the right height. So, yeah, I pretty much got to start this over. I flubbed it. Consarn it. Oh, well. Well, it's not that bad. I knew there was something about this level I wasn't remembering, though. Daggone it. Much better. Okay, but now I need to let him walk up before I actually cut through this bridge with my basher. Okay, he needs to go up to here, and he needs to... Okay, yes, there is a little crook here, I think. I think I see a little hole where it's easy for him to kind of mess this up. So, I'm going to get really... I'm going to try to get in tight. Try to get in high and tight before I... Okay, good. Whew! All right, that was... That was a close one. All right, so now... Now, once we get everything cut out here, once we cut out our little paper dolls, we should be able to... Okay, so here comes everybody. And now we want to hold to the right until we find... There we go. Otherwise, they would just walk in an endless cycle. And now we can cut through here. 
Okay, who is who's up front? We, why we got two guys so close to each other here? Not that there's anything wrong with that. Where's our where's our there's our athlete way in the back. Okay, so these guys are kind of separated out weird. I hope I can. Okay, sure, just keep going. That's or you know stop right there at the lip. That's cool too. Okay, we got guys who are coming in at a weird pace here. We only have one builder left, so I can't mess this up. All right, don't screw it up, jerk. Just lip up and then lip up again. Here we go. Here comes the leader. The leader is going to be the one to make this happen. I think he's going to. Oh, God, I hope he builds over that guy's head. That's looking a little risky. Those blockers, they know how to supremely block. Ah, there we go. Right over the head. Right nailed it. Yes. So now all we got to do is make sure that they can get up here. They Make sure that that guy did it. Because if I, if I screwed this up and they actually can't make it over that somehow, which is a possibility sometimes depending on if you build right on the edge of another thing. Okay, yes. Thank God they can walk up through it. I didn't want to have to start over from that point. Because, yeah, there's actually more to think about in this level than you actually originally think. Woohoo! Good thing I did not speed it up and then hit the nuke button. We got some we got some guys bringing up the rear here. You guys need to get into shape. You are the ones that are going to have us... Oh, hey. Hey there, athlete. You are the ones that are going to have us scrubbing the barracks with toothbrushes if you don't whip it into shape and march that marathon. There you go. There we go. Now we can just nuke the other guys who had to stay behind in their positions. Okay, 95% saved. That's good enough for me. I hope it's good enough for the level as well. Let's blow them up as the iguana stares on coldly. Oh, 90%. Wow, we just barely made it out of that one alive. Oh, yeah, because we could only kill six lemmings. That's right. There was a certain percentage at the beginning. That was right. I actually said it out loud. Kind of forgot it between all the between all the editing and the whatnot. Well then, let's continue. Let's move forward to the roundabout. Gonna make you out and out. We are gonna have to. Okay, we're gonna have to crush this one. I feel like this is one of those that's supposed to be exact. So you get you have to save a hundred percent and you get everything you need, tool wise. You get six builders. Okay. Okay, no blockers of any kind. Okay, yeah, I, I think I remember how to do this. All right, this guy's going to go on. He's going to be the hero. And we're also going to have him climb. Okay, so now we have to seal this up. We have to seal this up. Or do you do it with the first guy because the second guy's going to keep walking? Yeah, yeah, okay. <laughs> I get it, I get it, I see, I see. Ha ha, very funny. Okay, well then let's go ahead and seal it up with that first guy so that the second guy can be the hero. The first guy being the hero is not really how we're going to play this one. Okay, everybody's stuck in. Good, 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 good. Okay, so now we just have to have him go about his business. He's going to take a long journey of self-discovery. And I think we have to mine in such a way that we end up helping him out. We, we end up getting everybody out of here and then we're going to have a builder left over at the end okay yeah okay yeah I think I remember how this plays okay so now he's going to take he's going to take a long climb a long climb over brain hills and up the steel wall and he's going to climb up the big marble brick He's going to think about his life. He's going to think about his career choices. Was being a climber and a floater really the right career choice? I don't know. But it certainly gave him skills that came in handy in his life. So he can't say that he regrets it entirely. What am I even rambling on about? we got to go ahead and we got to dig now. This is another one of the hard parts of this level. Because you have to dig. Not only do you have to dig. But I have to build over to the... I have to build over to this. I have to make sure I hit it pretty much dead on. I think I have to... I think, yeah, I think I have to connect it to this. Because the guys, when I mine... When these guys are saved, they're going to come... I'm going to mine through here. 
and they're going to walk through this that I've bashed through, and they're going to have to walk down here and hit here in order to turn around. So yes, I have to build from a point that will reach exactly out, that will reach out and touch this brick pretty much exactly. I'm going to go ahead and try it from here. I'm going to try it, not saying I'm going to succeed, but I think I may have gone too low as a matter of fact. Okay, let's go ahead and, uh, yeah, let's go ahead and stretch. Let's stretch our muscles. I think that may have been helpful, actually. I think that may do it. Uh, yo! Oh, man, nailed it first try. Oh, that's always a satisfying feeling. Okay, so let's go and let's bash to the left now. Once he gets done, let's have him, let's introduce Super Lemming. Let's go ahead and have him do the Super Walk so that we get here much faster. All right, go ahead and, oh, yes, we have no, we have every assurance that he will not leave a thin sliver of wall that glitches through because they don't do that going to the left. They only do it going to the right. Okay, and I think we have a little landmark here to mine from. I think this... I think this might be a subtle hint. We might actually... You can kind of see the the marbling in this little brick here. I think that's a little subtle hint that that's where we're supposed to mine from. I'm going to take it as such anyway. And if we end up having to come from a little farther back, then that's not the worst thing in the world. Because we have replay and speed ups. So, you know, we get all the tries in the world to do this one thing, quite frankly. I can't stand the suspense. Is he going to save his fellow lemmings? Are they going to have enough of a enough of leeway to walk up onto there? They sure are. Wow, that was who? Wow, <laughs> could not have done much better than that. Okay, so now we have only to build a bridge. That's why we have the one bridge remaining. We build it to here, and everybody gets out safely. And I don't think Bronco was mean enough to put like a masher right here or anything. That would just be cruel. And you know what else is cruel? Green dresses. So now, okay, I think I can speed this up. I don't think it requires just the utmost precision in the world in order to build a bridge over a mining tunnel. There we go. Now what we have to worry about is people making that walk in a minute 36. I didn't realize that time was such a hassle here. Okay, so let's, uh, let's make sure that's not actually the hassle that I fear it might be. Um, oh gosh, oh, 50 seconds to walk all that way. I feel pretty confident that they can do it. Let's just slowly watch them saunter. They can't move any faster than their little legs will allow them to. So you know what? If they don't make it to the exit, it's my fault, not theirs. But I think they're going to. There we go. There we go. A nice level, nice little circle with a lot of good precision. That's a good level right there. Mwah. That is a spice to meet the ball. Very good. Very good work done today. We're going to stop there. And next time we're going to use our access code for level 7. Not really, because access codes are kind of redundant with Lim Mini. But I guess, you know, if you wanted to use a password, you could. Uh, well, I guess if you wanted someone to play a level, a specific level in a level pack... And you didn't want them to have to play through all the other levels first. You could be like, here's the access code. But really, that's the only use they would have in Lim Mini. And I think there's enough level sharing done over the internet that they can safely be called redundant. But what do I know? I'm just a goofball who LPs lemmings on the internet. And you love it. You know you do.